Good morning, I'm Mark Fine, and in the KCRE 3 weather office, keeping track of the storm that's blowing through Northern California. Many areas have had a bit of a lull in the rain the last couple of hours, but another wave of rain is moving through. Let me show you how it looks right now on Doppler radar. This is the last three hours, and you can see that many areas were in a lull, but now there is this next area of rain, and there are some embedded downpours in this. We have one right now that's going through the woodland area. It's pouring, it's just starting to rain heavy in Davis again, and it's almost into the Sacramento area. You notice some areas of yellow in here, like right over Fairfield, some heavier rain here. And then a little bit farther to the south, we've been seeing occasional lightning strikes like here in Tracy. So for those of you in Tracy, maybe you're getting woken up by a couple of rumbles of thunder. That's what you see here. And this is moving to the east. So this is going to head toward Ripon and Modesto with heavy downpours. The winds are also still somewhat gusty, but I, we haven't so far seen too many problems from the winds tonight. Just some scattered outages here and there. And I think that'll continue for the next couple of hours. Heading into the Sierra, we are also still seeing some snow at higher elevations up around 6,000 feet. So you're seeing snow here on 108 and 4. The last time I checked about 10 minutes ago, they are still holding traffic here on Highway 50. They're doing some avalanche control up near Echo Summit, and there aren't too, there isn't too much traffic up here anyway, but still we are still seeing some some holds from time to time in the Sierra because of the snow we have been seeing. The snow level well up the hill. It's now up around 6,000 feet, a big change from what we were seeing just a couple of days ago. I'll give you a peek at the way it looks up at Castle Peak. And as you can see, the road looks like it's in pretty good shape, but there are chain controls now up on Interstate 80. Let me give you a look at the wind that we are seeing. Many of you are probably hearing it still sustained winds around 25 miles an hour in many areas. We're getting a lot of gusts, 35, 38 miles an hour. We have had a couple of gusts around 50. Winds will stay gusty up until about 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning. And after that, the winds will not be an issue during the day on Friday. We'll keep you updated throughout the night.